Hello, Congo Slime here. I forgot to actually have the microphone turn on in this video. And we are back at St. Louis. St. Louis. And the only thing I needed were tires. Uh, critical things and uh, not much there for to buy and uh, how was your Christmas mine was okay uh, on Boxing Day I got a Nintendo switch for three hundred and twenty nine dollars at Superstore and went back there a a couple days for back in January and uh, well it, the rack that they had it in was no longer there and well the, the electronic section there in Superstore just slowly became non-existent over time and it sucks and I get past all these zombies slowly but surely without taking a shot. And I get the package. Yay, 50 ammo. I'm trying to figure out what I was doing here. The activity is high and still need tires. Everybody seems to be fine so far. And then I get that tire for the battery, which compromise that I had to go with. And I don't plan on scavenging because the zombies are too high for activity. And yes, so uh, oh yes, the cave versus the Badger City. I ultimately went with the cave for the money scavenger. You must cross a horde of zombies in order to continue on the road. The horde in front of the currently sized, large, pure ravenous. I break out the guns. And right here, it looks like I won't make it. And I just barely made it. So, since we fought way through horde. Muffler is acting, no, a mufflers is acting funny, but you ignore it. I am baffled by a mufflers. It's like, it should be a muffler. Some of their health go down. Sandstorm kicks up, you'll have to drive slowly due to low visibility. found an abandoned car but there was nothing to be scavenged which really sucks and there's the cave so 22 ammo or 9 fuel which I definitely went with a fuel oh, and I went with a shotgun Oh yes, and I was having mouse trouble because on the mouse pad, it's, I don't know, for whatever reason, it just doesn't want to work properly. It just goes flying all over the place. And sometimes when I don't uh, move the mouse, it stays in that position for whatever reason. Almost got hit there. Zombies crawling towards me, but failed to actually hit me. Should be there somewhere. 
and I get the gas. And I don't think I went for the ammo. Yeah, and I, I also had to get scraps. And this really did help for the money scavenger. Yes, and then I went for resting the team. So they can uh, not die on me or getting ca incapacitated. And here I just fix the car. Oh, wait, no, I examined how many scraps I had left and then I'm trying to figure out how to get scraps so I can fix the car or. Okay. Yeah, so then I get money to buy enough scraps to fix the car so I'm not stranded in the city and... Oh, yeah, that was just terrible. The stupid mouse was acting up. Yay, more scavenging. Yeah, it's acting up again. It's so annoying when it acts up like that. And I forgot to turn off my friggin' phone again! Or silent mode. Got some more money. Yeah, I escaped with 15 ounces of food and, well, already too late. I can remember how much I got from that. About uh, nine scraps. And then repairing the car, you ate a most entertaining part of it. Boop, boop. I don't know if that's probably gonna affect uh, the actual uh, the sound effect, which might be delayed for whatever reason. 14 scraps left. Using the Windows game bar is the absolute worst because I have no control over anything that happens. The audio sometimes is a bit uh, not consistent sounding, but train of thought going away. A bit glitchy and it's just annoying. This is the part where the come on, show up. deer show up, and I've always hated these because it's just you can always avoid them, and it was just was the whole point of this. You know, just avoid damage on the car. It was right until this part I knew I... Well, right here I messed up. I got hit by a stupid deal. Well, I survived the attack. And I made it to the pyramid. You hear a warning over the radio static, but can't make out what it's saying or something. Memphis. Oops. 
Seventeen dollars. Do I go for it? Yes, of course. All in it for the money. A lot of zombies popping up. Oh yes, I was distracted here for something and then I got, uh, I think the boss was being stupid or, no, I think, no, no, I had it been, I think my phone went off and then I was turning it to silent and then I didn't even notice the zombies coming up. And then I give one, say two med kits or three. And yeah, 33 fuel, like I'm good on that. And then I just scavenge for the time being. That hunter is not going to get that thing there. And then some money. With one lone zombie. Now they're crawling up and then, oh, I get distracted by a shopping cart of food. I'm trying to shoot these dudes down. Because they're gonna get me. Because they want my money. Yeah, I found 270 ounces of food. Carry 250 and found $50. Another bag of food. And a fast zombie. I was trying to aim at you, dead. And all them are dead. Can. And then another money bag. And I wasn't fast enough to get it. And I got it. And a piece of scrap up there. $50 and I have enough scraps to fix the car go back for scavenging and I found some more money oh right and then the boss bear comes up I never even defeated this thing before and it was so intense just to fight this thing thought I was gonna get hit because that's usually what happens and that, uh, that little speedy got there that was just scary he was like gonna actually get me and right about this point I thought I was actually gonna beat the bear and I didn't but I found $50 Yeah, I fixed the car using eight scraps. Only two combo, ugh. And then I just go back to four just to save on the scrap. That one was just terrible. Again, and it's better. Yes, it is better. Ish. And no jobs there. And everything in the scav or everything in the supplies is good. Two hundred forty-six dollars. I'm good on everything. And I leave town for the prison. I've 
bike gang follows you out of the settlement. Adams are not on this run because the zombies got them because there wasn't enough room in the car to sleep at all. Join in 35 miles to the prison. prison and that looks pleasant to be at really nice place and this will conclude this thing Kaga slam out <laughs>